Hello there, Whipper here, and today I'm going to be showing you a rather awesome mod called the Animated Player Mod. And what this basically does is overhauls the Minecraft animation system, so it um, animates your player models very well. So the first thing you're probably noticing is that my face is moving, which you've probably never seen before in Minecraft. And you can see that my eyebrows are going up and down, and my mouth is opening and closing as I breathe, so yeah. And also, you'll notice if I look left and right, my eyes actually move with where I'm looking, which is kind of freaky. And yeah, it also adds animations for punching, so when I punch you can see my arm bends. You can kind of see um, the inside of your arm a bit, but to solve that they'd have to add curves into Minecraft, and you can't add curves into a block game, it just wouldn't be right. And so yeah, it looks awesome really. And the next animation I'm going to show you is the walking animation. So if I walk forwards, you can see that my knees bend and my legs go back. Well, the bottom of my legs go back. Normally your legs would just be straight and just somehow manage to float forwards and backwards. But now it actually looks like you're actually using your legs to move instead of just floating everywhere. So there you go. And you can see that my arms also bend forwards as I walk. And the running animation is just basically just the sped up version of the walk animation, but your legs go back further and your arms go up further. So yeah, that's awesome. See if I can get a nice side view of that. So yeah, I'll just flick sideways so you can kind of see what's going on. And I'll just walk through a cactus. That must have hurt. Uh, anyway, so the next animation is the crouching animation. So if I crouch, you can see I got I start having a stance kind of thing and my back leg is kind of like floating in midair, but you can deal with that. I think what it crouch basically is, is just the slowed down version of the run. And yeah, my leg kind of goes into the sand a bit and then, you know, floats, but oh well. And everything's just slowed down, your arms go up slowly and everything. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all for the movements, apart from the jump. So when I jump, you can see my um, legs go up a bit and the bottom of them goes backwards a bit. And that's the same for the fly animation. So if I fly, you can see it's basically just the jump animation, but looped over and over again. And this is where you can really see that you've got like massive deep gashes in your elbows which doesn't look very nice that must hurt but anyway if we plop down here and and now I'm going to show you the rather awesome parts of this mod which are the bow charging animations and the blocking animations so if I charge this bow you can see that my arm actually bends as I charge the bow and you can see the joint moving and yeah it looks better than normal and there you go. And the awesome thing is that you can combine this with the crouch animation and you have like an awesome stance as you pull back the bow. Like that. That's what I wanted to show you. Sometimes it glitches and you get weird animations but this is what I want to show you. It's like a hero's stance on a rock or something. But there you go. So you can charge that and then look awesome as you fire your bow. And it looks even better when your eyebrows are down when you're doing it because it looks like you're angry and ready to shoot and kill a creeper or something. But there you go. And the next one I'm going to show you is the blocking animation. So if I block, you can see that my legs go out a bit, and my arms go out a bit, and I take up the stance for blocking. Like you would in real life, I suppose. Instead of your sword just magically flipping 90 degrees to be in front of your body. It's now actually fully animated, which is a lot better to look at, I suppose. And um, what I've noticed with this one, if you crouch and block, you just um, like sink into the ground. It doesn't have an animation for crouched and blocking yet. So that might be added in the future, but for now you'll just be half in the ground and a bit smaller than usual. But there we go. And now I think I'll show you the swimming animation. So if we go over here to some water. So if I go like that and start swimming, you can see my I've got the swimming action and my legs kick up and down and I do the nice stroke action. And there we go. So now I'm going to show you the awesome riding animation. So it's also added an animation for riding pigs. So if I plunk down a pig here and place a saddle on it, like that, get on it, and... Okay. Now go! It doesn't appear like I can... Um, there we are. Now I should be able to control it. I forgot to right click. But here we go. So now I'm going to show you what it looks like. So that's the back view. And you can see my arms are bent and legs are bent. And this is the front view. So I'm actually riding the pig and not like I would do sitting on a boat or something like that. So there we go. I can just walk around and check out that awesome pig. But yeah, there we go. So 
That basically covers all the animations in this mod. It's probably one of the best mods I've seen so far, which um, changes the animations in Minecraft. And you can see it's very compatible because I've currently installed um, the shaders mod as well as the better animations mod with the um, squid tentacles and stuff and the fluffy wolf tails. And I've also got the hats mod. Now, this is an interesting one. I wanted to show you this. So if I go into the hats and then I'll find my favourite hat here. The top hat. And uh, why isn't it adding? Oh yeah, I forgot to click done. Derp. So add that. And you can see that sometimes I can see through it, but that's, I think, a bug with um, the shaders mod and nothing else. But when I walk, you can see it like my hat bobs up and down and floats above my head. I think that's kind of cool, although not intentional. But there we go. And, of course, it's not going to be fully compatible with the um, player animations mod. Because it's just not suited to fit the models that this one adds. So, yeah. And if I, like, crouch and stuff. It's funny when I fly, because... It just kind of glitches inside my head. But if you really wanted to use the hats mod with this mod, you can actually do it. So just a heads up on that one. And there you go. So yeah, as I said, it's really compatible with a load of mods. So you can pretty much use it with anything you want, really. Although there are a few mods that it doesn't work with. And you can probably find those out if you check out the Minecraft forum thread. But there we go. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next mod video. And I strongly suggest that you download this mod because it's friggin' awesome. So yeah. See you next time.